Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be doing my unboxing of my Ipsy and BoxyCharm boxes and bags. So I'm super excited, I know it's been forever. I am super happy to be back and hopefully I will have more videos soon. We've got Ipsy's glam bag to start. I actually did get a few extra items this month, which I will share with you guys as well. This is the bag that we've got for our Ipsy glam bag. They also sent me a Refreshments Dazzling 5 Blade Razor Kit in Neon Fizz. I actually got one of these razor kits in the past and I absolutely loved it. It worked really, really nicely. It glides right on your skin. <laughs> it's a really nice razor set. I also like that it sticks onto your shower and then the actual razor is magnetic onto this piece. So you just pop it on and off super easy. They also sent me their refreshments, pillowy shave cream and citrus spritz. I love citrus scented products, so I'm really excited to try this out. The razor bag was sent to me as a little extra bonus in my PR package from them, which was super duper nice. All right, so moving on to our glam bag, same bag as the razor set. We have got some awesome items. Some of these are actually really nice sizes. I believe this is a full size from e.l.f. This is their Power Grip Primer plus 4% niacinamide. I haven't used e.l.f. in years. When I first came across e.l.f., every single product on the e.l.f. website was $1. Every single product. Now they've evolved so much over the years and their products have gotten a lot better than what they actually started as. I got what looks like a full size Seraphine Botanical Liquid Coal Water Resistant Liquid Eyeliner. I've gotten a Seraphine Botanical Eyeliner before and I really liked it. We have got a face brush. This is a blending brush in B9 by Toy Factory. It's a cute handle, super pretty. And then the brush, I will say the brush got kind of squished in the package. Not the biggest fan of that. However, the bristles feel very, very soft, really nice. Although some of the bristles are kind of bending out because of the packaging. Next product we've got is by Mud Masky. This is the Vitamin A Booster French Clay Mask, and this is for pH balanced skin, pore refining, smoothing, firming, tightening, and clarifying, and it's fragrance free. I really like this glam bag because, and I'm not usually a fan of the glam bags just because I like the full size products, but this is half of an ounce. Everything else is full size, which doesn't usually happen. Usually it's like tiny little samples. And then this one, I believe is a full size product again. Nice. So we've got the Lottie London four piece eyeshadow palette. There's some really pretty shimmer shades in there. Two matte shades and two shimmer shades. It's kind of like a brownie, pinky, kind of like a neutral tone. So I like that. All right, we are going to move on to the Ipsy BoxyCharm box. Let's get into it. I'm excited. I did previously already open this up. The first item, this is by Rodial a Vitamin C Brightening Cleanser, Brighten and Renew. Very nice size package. It is 4.6 fluid ounces. I like the pump bottle to it and it's pretty color. I know Rodial's products are really expensive too. We have got by Verb, this is the Ghost Exfoliating Scalp Nectar. I saw this on the spoilers and I really wanted to get this in my box. So because it came in my PR package, I'm really excited to try it. Choice did just happen though and it was in my choices but because I got it in this I was able to choose something else for my choice and able to try a different product. This helps clarify, refresh, and balance your scalp. I have a very oily scalp and lots of buildup on my scalp but my hair is actually dry past my scalp area. Using a scalp exfoliator, scalp scrub, whatever does wonders to my hair and scalp. I can't wait to try this one. I have got the Lucky Chick Lip and Cheek Multi Stick. A lot of brands are coming out with multi sticks nowadays. This is cool. And we've got a really pretty pink mauve shade. Super pretty. What do you guys think? <laughs> Okay, so going on my lips, it feels like a very thin formula, meaning it feels a little bit hydrating, but it doesn't feel very, very moisturizing, if that makes sense. Like, it doesn't feel like it's going to last a while, but we'll see. We'll see. It's going to take a few tries to 
figure everything out. All right, next product we have got the box, the eyeshadow box. We got Natasha Denona. Like I did say before, I did previously open this because I was just too excited. I got this palette. One of the shades is completely shattered. If you guys get this in your box, I really, really hope that yours does not come broken because mine did. We'll try to fix that. I'm still gonna use it. I love this palette, really, really pretty. I would say the blue is probably gonna be a little bit difficult to use, maybe for Halloween or doing a crazy look or something, but it, it's really, really pretty. And it just, to me, it calls like gold goddess. And the last product I have got today is by Wing Me, and this is the clear brow gel. I have a lot of brow gels, a lot, a lot of brow gels. Oh, wow, wow. It's about three inches long. Most eyebrow gels are like half of that. There's a big tube. Definitely won't be traveling with me because it's so large. However, this will be nice to leave on my countertop to use as I'm getting ready in the morning. So we've got our glam bag products. I have to tell you guys, I am actually really excited about these products being amazing sizes. I feel like this is worth it, totally worth it. Overall, for the glam bag, 10 thumbs up. I think this is an amazing deal. So now I'm moving on to our BoxyCharm box by Ipsy. It's a pretty good box in my opinion. Um, it could have been a little bit better, but it is a pretty good box, I would say. Getting Natasha Denona, super duper nice. Again, like I said, hopefully yours doesn't come broken. Scalp exfoliator, I really, really could use this in my life. I have a ton of cleansers, um, but I'm excited to try this one. Brightening is always, always great. Uh, this multi-stick, I really like the color. The formula I'm a little bit unsold on just because it kind of feels a little bit thin and dry, not like thick and moisturizing. I feel like this will work really great on my skin, on my face, my larger areas of my face, but on my lips, I don't know how much I like it. And then this brow gel, I love the size of it. Amazing size. Overall value, I think I got some great stuff this month. Thank you so much, Ipsy, for sending this for me to try. Every single month, I look forward to these unboxings. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Um, welcome back. <laughs> I will hopefully have more videos soon. And I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe. Hit that like button. Sorry for Ollie's tail. Oh, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.